Hey, welcome back to our Hungry Adventures and welcome to Sorobori, guys. Yeah, today we begin our northern Thai tour, a tour on a motorbike to the northern Thailand. However, the north is quite far from Bangkok, yeah, it's a long way. Which is why I have decided to make a few stops on the way and visit a few interesting places to make the beginning more exciting, yeah. That's why we are in Sarabori today, yeah. It's a lovely province, beautiful province in central Thailand, and there are quite many places to see. A national park, a waterfall, numerous temples, few limestone cliffs with caves, which I love a lot, yeah. So probably this episode is going to be really interesting, because there will be also delicious food. So if you got some time and empty space in your stomach and you are ready to spend your precious time together with me, or even waste your precious time together with me, while I'm hanging around, then join me in this hungry adventure. So let's go! Okay, I'll, I'll have a needle on. Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to our Hungry Adventures. Traditional Hungry Adventures where I'm trying unknown for me Thai food and telling you what I feel, what I think. Yeah, this one is called Gengua uh, Hoi Kom. It is freshwater snails in red curry. I can show it closer to you. And this one is called Nampik Kung, which is basically dipping sauce made of uh, shrimp paste and fresh shrimps with chili, with shallots, with something else, maybe garlic, we'll find out later, and vegetables. And this food attracts lots of flies, so I've got to turn on my ninja mode here to protect my food. Mmm, sweet and sour, salty not that spicy and yeah i can see here is the fresh shrimp mm. so now we're gonna try this snails freshwater snails let's do it together with rice because i believe it's gonna be spicy very hot no shells and this restaurant is located in only 10 minutes drive from the city center of Saraburi. Buonissimo! Bellissimo! Bellissimo! Buonissimo! And simply beautiful! And before we continue exploring this beautiful province, I'd like to thank Surfshark VPN for sponsoring today's episode and for supporting this channel once again. VPN is a virtual private network which I find really necessary to use in our daily life, because we spend a lot of time online, at work, on a trip, when we go out, when we do shopping, and quite often we connect to public Wi-Fi in shopping malls and restaurants and hotels and airports. And usually public Wi-Fi doesn't provide a secure connection. But Surfshark VPN can help to be safe while using public Wi-Fi because it encrypts all the data that you are sending through the internet, such as your passwords or your credit card number, and makes it unavailable for people in services that steal such information. Also, when I went to Russia for holidays, I have found out that I can access Line Messenger. It's blocked there, yeah. And I use Line app every day because it's the most common way to communicate in Thailand. Yeah. All my friends are using Line app. And in order to talk to my friends, I had to change my virtual location using VPN. And Surfshark bypasses such censorship and geo-blocking, so you can even unlock your video library on Netflix. 
and watch completely different movies. If you're in Thailand, you can watch American Netflix. If you're in US, you can watch movies from British Netflix video library. It also allows unlimited devices on one account. Your phone, your laptop, your TV. And right now, if you sign up using promo code MIKI, you'll get 83% discount plus 4 extra months for free. I'll put the link in the description below. It is also risk-free because Surfshark offers 30-day money-back guarantee, so if you won't like it, you can get a refund and spend it on your lunch. Guys, the link is down below, please check them out. Welcome to Wat Tam Krabok. Tam means a cave, and I can see there are stairs leading somewhere up to the hill. We gotta check it out. And here behind me there is a collection of different uh, statue of, statues of Buddha. This is not a new temple complex, everything looks pretty modern, but it looks amazing. It's quite big, yeah. And besides its beauty, this place is also an international rehab center for drug addicts, yeah. So if someone is having problems with drugs, this someone can come here, and monks will try to help, yeah, to help with this problem. These standing Buddha images are really huge. All statues here are huge, all images of Buddha, really big. And you feel yourself so small here. It's a good reminder that we are just tiny, tiny creatures. We are only visitors on this planet, in this world. And our lifetime is very short. So we need to stay positive. Really many bats, very many bats. ดีครับวันนี้คุณมีของว่างไหมครับนี่เป็นเตียงคู่เตียงแปะอ๋อเตียงดับเบิลไม่มีใช่ไหมครับเต็มอ๋อเต็มอ๋อหนึ่งขึ้นเท่าไรครับหกร้อยบาทหกร้อยบาทมีอาหารเช้าอ๋อเหรออะโคดโคดูของได้ไหมครับคุณเพราะว่าผมทัวร์ใหญ่ผมไม่รู้มีน้ำตกด้วย Well guys, the room cost 600 baht only here and it's a brand new hotel. It's called Charlotte Smart Hotel Lobbury. Everything looks really new. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This hotel is located next to Big C. Big C is not really far, and next to one. Pretty brand new market, the market which is only about one year old. So I think I gotta take a ride. It's about two, three minutes, and check it out. Maybe buy something delicious, some delicious street food, and then we can finish this day and jump into the next day. Yeah, and to the next province probably. So I'll see you in the market. Guys, <laughs> you probably see I'm smiling right now because this market is alive. 
It's called Z1 Market. It is located in the, in the center of Laburi city. And even though it's a weekday, not a weekend, it's alive. I can see there are many street food vendors selling their foods. Huge variety of street foods. There is music somewhere in the distance. They've got huge dining area. So this place is really alive. Not just on weekend, right now. In the middle of November. Wow. ขวดขวดนี่ตอนแรกครับ 35 บาทโอเคอันนี้ครับโคเปอร์เดมะครับไม่ไม่เอาทงโคเปอร์อยากกินเลยครับ 6-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-4-
really peaceful temple complex with large statue of Buddha, a white Buddha on the hill. 436 steps leading up there, but it's afternoon, <laughs> so I'm not going there because I'll burn and won't be able to drive anymore. Yeah, but there is another temple on the top, another building, so we can visit it because it's not that high, not that far. Let's go. Beautiful, quiet, peaceful, but unfortunately closed right now. Yeah. We're still recovering from the pandemic. We're still getting used to the new normal. Hopefully next year this place will be open. Worth visiting though, even now. Hopefully in Pichabun more places will be open. Because we're going to Pichabun next. Yeah. <laughs> this place is the reason why I have decided not to climb to the white Buddha statue on the top. It's another hike, yeah, 20 minutes hike on the top of the hill, which is called Pusa Black. I need you Pusa Black, Chema Cup. Teach you Pusa Black. Kuntam Tini Titi Alo Tini Ayu Gidun Gippi Ruapon Kitwa to con my Lujak Tini Chemakap Nimpi Nimpi Leo. Ah, okay, okay. Let's go into the jungle. So oh, they are cooking something or burning something. <laughs> I need my <my> barbecue, am I? <laughs> yeah, the smell of. Huh? Some clip yoga by Tio and I love bully. Chai. Logo by Pichabung. What is last year? Last year. Last year. Last year. Last Last year. 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 โอ้ยถึงว่าเธอพูดภาษาไทยเค้าเนาะได้นิดหน่อยนิดเดียวโอ้ยหมอแล้วเนี่ยนะฮะกล้วยทอดกล้วยทอดอือฮึแล้วก
I gotta save the breath. This gentleman has done a really fantastic job here on the top of the of this hill. So many beautiful rocks, which made like a stone garden, you know, like Japanese garden of stones with different trees, beautiful trees, green, yellow, and so on. Trees and plants, and the view is marvelous, guys. A really marvelous view. He made this place one year ago, so if you haven't been to Lobbury for a while then maybe you don't know about this place yet I recommend to visit it and the, the view behind me really reminds me mountains of Prashuap Khan or mountains of Krabi beautiful check it out And by the way, somewhere there, you see this huge mountain cliff, this range, yeah, the major on the horizon. Somewhere there is the temple complex we have just visited. I mean, like one hour ago. Ooh. So far and so close at the same time, but the view is really marvelous. And there is another Buddha statue at the bottom, in the middle of this hill. Yeah, and there are quite many temples in this area. There is another temple complex. So probably when I will start exploring central provinces of Thailand, I'll come to Lobori 100%. And we'll visit Monkey City too. Guys, this room costs 350 baht, 12 dollars US. What do you expect to get for 12 dollars US? If you ask me, personally, I expect for 350 baht, I don't expect, I don't expect there will be four walls. 
I don't expect there will be a roof in the room, yeah, but here we've got everything. Here is air conditioning, which is not loud to be honest, yeah. Here is the bed, shower, working toilet, hot water, not bad. Here is the fridge, TV, huge like my ass to be honest, but still you can watch Thai television. However, for this rate, it's impossible to get blankets, yeah, which is why I'll be using this beach, 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 beach. Beach. <laughs> beach towels, yeah. Cherry beach towels instead of blankets. But considering the fact we are in Thailand, we don't really need blankets, yeah, unless we are somewhere in the north. Uh, or unless we will turn air conditioning, put air conditioning on 18 degrees or something like in 7 Eleven or like in Bangkok Taxi. Anyway, my head is not working anymore. I literally can't talk any longer. <laughs> I need shower, I need sleep. <sighs> if, you if you have had fun while watching this video, if it was nice to watch, if you have enjoyed this tour, hit the like button, share this video with your friends and subscribe to this channel if you aren't already. Share this video with your friends. It's really important. Your like really matters. Hit the like button. Write me a comment. Turn the notifications on if you don't want to miss the new videos because sometimes you don't receive, uh, you don't see the new videos, new updates. Yeah, so it's very important to turn all notifications on if you don't want to miss a meeting, if you don't want to miss our time together. And I'll see you in the next episode very soon from Pechabun province. Bye bye.